say this about Kevin. Kevin went to summer camp just a few years ago, a couple of years ago, and uh, Kevin was a young man needing direction in his life when he went to camp. Yes. Got filled with the Holy Ghost and Woo! been serving God with it faithfully ever since. Yes. Just loves the Lord right now. So, Kevin, get ready. We're going to baptize you upon your profession of faith. Go ahead, man. Upon your profession of faith in Jesus Christ, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Cassie is uh, desires to be rebaptized tonight, and uh, she uh, was baptized at camp last year. But she was uh, filled with the Holy Ghost about three weeks ago, and just desires to be baptized again. Okay. Well, Cassie, upon the confession of your faith in the Lord Jesus Christ, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yes. Hey, David. Hey, no problem. <laughs> hey, David. <laughs> David Ricky, upon the confession of your faith in Lord Jesus Christ, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Chris, I'm going to say something about Chris. I've noticed his change in life, and it's cool to always see uh, just kids, just just a, a total uh, opposite change in his life, and just a willing to serve, and that's just an awesome thing to see. And so, Chris, on your, upon your uh, effect, confession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yes! All right. Hot, hot, it's hot water. It's not it's cold water, it's hot. It's like a jacuzzi. Amen. Josh has been uh, going to church here for uh, quite a while and uh, he desires to be baptized tonight. And uh, I've just seen Josh also serve the Lord, uh, been a faithful servant. Uh, to also be involved in our uh, drama program. But John, upon your profession of faith in Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yes. All right. Steve Jones, upon the confession of your faith today, we baptize you in the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Brother Bobby both wanted to get baptized tonight because they they said when we came here it, it made a difference in our lives and I believe what that what in their words they said we just we, we really God really became real to them and they just began to serve God and if you look at Bobby and John's life both of them they're serving God in everything that they do. So, Bobby we baptize you tonight we call them the profession of your faith in Jesus Christ and the Father Son and the Holy Ghost. Yes. Actually, that was John Brown. I said Bobby. He, I do that all the time. They don't. Hey, this is Bobby Brown. Bobby, upon your profession of faith in Jesus Christ, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Well, I, I, I'm, I'm thinking, Jeff, you're, this is a, a rebaptism, right? Have you ever been baptized before? When he was little. Well, I know this. I know, and we've had we had Jeff stand up and testify in youth service. Jeff, uh, not too many months ago, wasn't serving the Lord, and and he told all our young people. He said, "I, I was playing games." He said, "But he he made it right with God, and he wants to get baptized." He said, "Now I'm serving God." And I, when he, the night he come up to me to talk to our young people, I could just look in his face and tell that there was something different in Jeff's life. The young man had God all over him, and he was just happy and excited. Not that we can't be happy and excited without God, but you could see God in his face. And so, Jeff, tonight we baptize you upon your profession of faith in Jesus Christ. We baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Amen. faithfully every Wednesday night. Uh, we, uh, we're just, we, we love Nathan, him and his sister Rebecca all, both, and uh, just come faithfully every Wednesday night. And I believe uh, this is your first time, first baptism, Nathan? Nathan just want us, wants to follow what the heart change that is taking place in his life by uh, just following in the footsteps of Jesus Christ by being baptized. So Nathan, upon your profession of faith of Jesus Christ, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yeah. special relationship because her mama is my my daughter's soccer coach but uh, Sonia has been coming for quite some time now also and uh, she wanted to be baptized tonight and uh, uh, I just believe that Sonia loves the Lord I know that I see that and she just loves coming on Wednesday night and uh, Sonia upon your profession of faith of Jesus Christ we baptize you tonight in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Christ is your Lord and Savior. We baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Jesus Christ, I, I know that. She come up and, and received Christ as her personal Savior. I, I think it was just a confirmation thing for her. Uh, and, and she said she come up and said she wanted to be baptized also. Just wanted to follow uh, the Lord in, in baptism. And uh, Trisha, I believe, is uh, just the change I've seen in young people's lives when they begin to follow God is just an awesome thing to witness. So Trisha, upon your uh, profession of faith in Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Um, she started coming just in the past like a month and a half, and uh, 
this girl has changed dramatically and he can totally change the countenance and um, how she approaches life. And it's been a blessing for me to be her Sunday school teacher and, and to work with her in Girls Only and, and the youth group. So Regine, upon the confession as Jesus Christ is your Lord Savior, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. up and we asked them if they were, were saved and we asked them if they wanted to be baptized. We didn't want to baptize people if they did not want to do it. But she wrote on the back of her something that I thought was very special. She said, I did this long ago, but it means something to me now. And so we, Kelsey, want to baptize you because not just because we're just baptizing people, because I believe you understand what's happening and why you're doing this, that you're following Jesus. So Kelsey, upon the confession of your faith in Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. All right! Woo! Woo! <laughs> These are my baby. <laughs> and the girls on the grill. <laughs> Uh, I don't I don't know um, you guys I'm sure everyone's met Emily and Naomi and their parents but I don't know that in youth we've had too many new people have caused quite a stir as these two they're so popular and they're such great girls and um, I'm excited to baptize Emily tonight. Miss Emily Benson upon your confession of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ I baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Is that it? <laughs> to make sure we've got everybody. Yes. Is that it? Amen. Let's give the Lord a hand. You may go into the building now. <laughs> 